China's strange phenomenon, it still snows near June. Although it is almost June, but on May 25, many places in Jilin City suddenly appeared unusual snowfall. On the same day, in Rua Air Kai District, Sichuan Province also had heavy snowfall. This natural phenomenon caused netizens to discuss enthusiastically. May snow in Jilin is on the most searched keyword list on Weibo. Mainland netizens feel that this year's weather is very unusual. Hong Kong's headliner newspaper reported on May 25 that many places in Jilin appeared snow, and Changbai Mountain was also covered with white snow as if it had entered winter. Video circulating online showed that many places in Jilin were covered with white snow, including an open-air parking lot of a residential area. The above article said that the scene was like a fairy tale world, but netizens had different opinions. One netizen commented, I feel the weather this year is very strange. Great omen, what's to admire? The world is chaotic. Another netizen said, the snowfall in early May is unusual enough, but at the end of May there is still snow, it can be said that it is summer snow. In the end, what's wrong with this? Not only Jilin had snow, also on May 25, the Rua Air Kai Steppe, Sichuan province was also covered with white snow. Sichuan Radio and Television reported that, on May 25, Rua Air Kai District appeared heavy snow. In addition, the internet also spread a video recording the heavy snowfall seen in Mo City, Heilongjiang province on the afternoon of May 22. Earlier, on June 29, 2020, while many other areas in China are hot and humid weather, the prairie by Anbulak, Xinjiang has occurred matches snowstorm, making horses, cattle and sheep no grass to eat. Summer snowfall is an extremely rare natural phenomenon. According to traditional Chinese culture, where there is snow in the summer, it means that there are unjust things that are hidden in the sky. According to media reports, in recent years, the Chinese Communist Party, CCP, government has set up re-education camps in Xinjiang, which the CCP calls the move to fight extremism and advance there may be more than a million Uyghurs and other Muslim minorities being held in these camps, UN experts say. Human rights activists claim that these people have been mistreated, psychologically tortured, brainwashed, or even killed. Kuang also includes economic exploitation.